Matter of days in a local community, two shootings left three people dead, seven people injured. The first happened at Doubles Nightclub in Hamilton. And then the second happened in the middle of a busy street right in the middle of the afternoon. Today, officials announced more charges and confirmed the two cases are connected. Local 12's Larry Davis is live in Hamilton with more on the progress in the investigation. Hi, Larry. Hi, Cammy. Notable among the indictments returned today, no murder charge against Mondale Goins. He was originally charged with the murder of his own brother at Doubles Nightclub. But now another man has been indicted for that killing. Now, the police chief here in Hamilton says there could very well be more people charged in these revenge killings. Of the eight people indicted, Michael Tracy Grievous was charged in both shootings. Cornell McKinney was charged in the shooting death at Doubles. And Tony Petit, Melinda Gibby, and Zachary Harris were charged in the Central Avenue shooting and were allegedly hired. Police say the shooting on Central Avenue was tied to the double shooting and cooperation from the public paid off in the first. And I had said a couple weeks ago that the cooperation we received from the double shooting was shameful. And it's still not where we want it to be, but it has improved significantly and it has contributed to us being able to secure these indictments. But Chief Craig Bukai says cooperation has been lacking in the drive-by shooting on Central Avenue, which claimed two lives. One of the victims there was shot at doubles. The shootings have led to tension in the neighborhoods, tension that clergy and neighborhood leaders have been working to defuse. They have been preaching one simple message. It's just not worth your life, you know. The violence is not worth going to jail. It's not worth, you know, having your mother left to cry and mourn you. It's not, let, you know, if you have children, it's not worth your kids not growing up with their parents not there. It's just not worth it. Think about your consequences, your actions before you do these things. It's not worth it. And Cammie, the announcement of today's uh, indictments come as... Uh, uh, Hamilton police have an open house here, as you can see behind me here, an open house and cookout as they reach out to the community, uh, the people here in the, uh, the, the second ward here in Hamilton. And again, they're reaching out to the community just like they were reaching out to try to find some answers, to get some people to talk about uh, th these cases and to get some leads to who may have been involved in these shootings. But Pastor Shack, as we saw there in the piece, says that the work in the neighborhoods will be ongoing. She says this is not a microwave fix. Live in Hamilton, Larry Davis, Local 12 News. Cammie, back to you. All right, Larry, thank you. Mondale Goins, who was originally charged with the killing of his brother, was indicted by the grand jury on two counts of felonious assault. The last arrest was made just an hour ago. Police are still looking for one suspect. There's a